Absolutely breaking news. Elon Musk tells advertisers to go fuck themselves on national television. Now I'm going to take you a lot deeper in this video. So in this video, I'm going to show you the video of Elon Musk telling advertisers to fuck off and what this is going to do, what this is going to do and the separation that's being created. And I'm going to show you the macroeconomic thing that's going to happen in 2024, which is going to affect you greatly as the middle class. The good news, if you understand this, not understand this, and you're on the right side of this, you could transform your family's life. But what Elon did yesterday was a signal of the separation of consciousness. So first, we're going to watch the video. Second, I'm going to show you how I predict the future by studying the past. Doesn't make me clairvoyant. It's easy to see the future when you know past patterns. And lastly, at the end of the video, I'm going to share with you exactly what I'm doing. No bullshit from my paradigm. This is not financial advice. I'm only speaking my truth. Watch this. What was that trip like? And obviously, you know that there's a public perception that, and, and, and you're clarifying this now, um, but there's a public perception that that was part of a apology tour, if you will. That this had been said online, there was all of the criticism, there was advertisers leaving. We talked to Bob Iger today. I hope today. they stop. You hope? Uh, don't advertise. You don't want them to advertise? No. What do you mean? If, if somebody's gonna try to blackmail me with advertising, blackmail me with money, go f yourself. But go f yourself. Is that clear? Is it clear? Is it clear enough? The separation in consciousness, the radical transformation from the old industrial era, the old archaic banking system, the greed, the disgusting behaviors that are happening at the top of the house. Religious people call it the rapture. People like me who follow God and the principles of just Jesus and love humanity call it the great awakening and the World Economic Forum calls it the great reset. I think we can all agree there's a separation in consciousness. But I'm here to tell you that that news right there shows you how separated things are about to become. The middle class is getting wiped out. There will be very, very wealthy and very, very poor. And I'll take you into the macroeconomics. At the same time, all this is happening. You're in a high interest rate environment and high inflation. They're trying to cool it. I've been telling you guys and warning you guys, and I predicted it and nailed it. The job markets on the back of 2023 and going into 2024 as we head into a recession are going to get rocked. And in 2024, it's all coming out now that they believe that they're going to lower interest rates. But pay attention. You think being indoctrinated, lowering interest rates is going to be good for you? Absolutely not, unless you're an investor. As the Bitcoin halving happens in April, the Bitcoin ETFs get approved in first quarter. Crypto is going to go absolutely parabolic. And if they lower interest rates, all assets are going to go through the roof. So unless you're an investor, this is going to help you. So if they lower interest rates and you have an $800,000 house you're looking at, it's going to shoot up over a million dollars. And the normal everyday American is no longer going to be able to afford a home. Companies are going to be laying off and you're going to need a stimulus. But here's the good news. If you play this correctly, and I'm just speaking from my paradigm, how I changed my family's life from 2019 to today and how I stopped doing what the 99% did. I started studying how money flowed through the system. I started studying history, deep history to predict patterns. And I've been able to nail it and change my family's life. So what Elon just did basically showed how deep the separation is becoming. That presidential election next year is going to rock everything. So here's what I've done. As I invested in a speculative asset starting 2019, early, late 2019 and 2020, in an asset called cryptocurrency. I realized very early it's extremely speculative and I only put money in there that I could afford to lose. I also was losing everything because they shut down my business. So I humbled myself and I decided to go completely frivolous. I moved back in with my parents. So if that just turns you off, if you can't stay till the end of the story, and I'm not the right guy to follow. I moved back in with my parents in 2020. And I worked to increase my earned income and reduce my expenses. And I put as much as I could into the speculative asset called crypto because I knew something was coming. And from 2020 to 2022, we were able to make a large amount of money in a short amount of time. But I went deeper. I realized that the indoctrination system that crypto was not my retirement. I went into things like insurance, tax code 7702. And as you secure your, you insure your house, you insure your car, I insure my money. I also expanded in business into education, information, and technology. I also started to learn about precious metals, and I dove and spent over $100,000 on self-development, and I rewired my foundation. 
And as I studied how money flowed through the system and studied historical patterns, these times that look extremely volatile and extremely scary become the greatest times. Number one, to rewire your foundation, to raise your frequency, but number two, to free your family financially. So as I sit today, I dollar cost average every Friday into a speculative asset called crypto. I never put more than I can afford to lose. And as everybody's coming in in 2024, when this thing goes absolutely parabolic, I will be exiting the market. I have an exit plan as it goes up, as you're coming in. I pull profits and I secure in tax code 7702 max funding insurance policies. That gives me the ability to compound and grow my wealth, protect my principal, and gives me the ability to borrow against my cash value. I also continue to increase my earned income through business using information, technology, and attention. I have precious metals. I have silver. I'm going into gold because assets are going to go through the roof next year. And I'm also not a real estate expert, but I need to get more real estate because of my earned income increasing from being at my parents' couch all the way to where I'm at now, financially free. And now I have a different problem, trying to figure out tax liabilities to decrease my tax bill. So if I can do it, you can do it. But if you grew up like me in the indoctrination system with a poverty state of mind, you have to rewire the foundation. So I've devoted my life to this. I've devoted my life to raising my high consciousness as high as possible, what I call Christ consciousness. I've devoted my life to understand macro and microeconomics, to free my family financially, to have absolute freedom of time, freedom of choice, and freedom of speech. And lastly, I've now educated other people on how to do that. So I love you guys. I appreciate you. As we always say, warriors, rise. Get your shit together. Let's go. Love you guys. Remember, extremely important, I will never proactively DM you. That is not me asking about your portfolio. Those are scammers. There's thousands of them. Thousands of them. I have free resources in my bio. You can set up a free consultation with my insurance team. I'm a licensed insurance agent. I teach people how to insure the wealth like I do. Okay, It's absolutely free. Number two is we have a free 16-page guide that shows you exactly what I'm doing. I only speak from my paradigm. Okay, you can see exactly what I'm doing. It's a 16-page book. And lastly, if you're ready to jump in, you can jump into our paid academy, our education academy, part of our ecosystem, if you choose to. And that's seven days for free as well. So tons of free resources. We are not asking you to send us money. I will never ask about your portfolio. That is not me. Do not send anybody money pretending to be me or any other influencer in this space. That is not them contacting you. I guarantee you they will never ask you to send them money on these platforms. If they are, then... They're bad people, but I don't think any influencer is reaching out to you and asking about your portfolio in the financial space. I love you guys. Appreciate you. Use discernment.